I tell you what, this is a big opportunity for Alabama State to make a statement here on the road. Makes the handoff over the middle, complete! Big yardage for Alabama State to start this ball game out. The FAMU territory. Swing pass to the outside and another first down and a little bit more for Alabama State. To the top of the screen, empty set. Out to Howe. Back to the line of scrimmage. Boy, Alabama State oh, coming oh, out with oh, all kinds of state. Second down and 10. Uh -oh. Great defense by Florida a and And that time, nobody was fooling. That's an over battle today. They are plus two on the season. Third down and 19. The ball is loose on the ground, and it is recovered by Alabama State. When it's third and 10 or more. Harrison Tuck on to punt. He's the freshman from Australia, and it will come down inside the 10-yard line at about the six. Back here in Tallahassee, Florida A&M starting here on offense and a completed pass in this drive out. Give to the running back. And a game on first down, out past the 20. First quarter action here in Tallahassee. Musa with a nice fake. Gets it out to his wide receiver. That's going to be Marcus Riley who gets across the 30-yard line. First down, Florida a &M. Musa with a fresh set of downs. Big run here by Florida a &M, close to a first down. Pickups on first down and it opens up the playbook on second. Musa looking. Complete big catch by the tight end Kamari Young. Musa looking, steps up in the pocket. Going deep and it's incomplete. Pass was in control, control the line of scrimmage. Musa with the give. Terrell Jennings, Terrell Jennings gets the carry. Musa, swing pass. Big game for Florida AM. Uh -oh. First down, and that could be a late hit. I expect the flag to come coming in. Cherie to the opposite side of the field now. Musa looking. Musa going to the end zone. Touchdown, Marcus Riley. Six on the board for the Rattlers. Great Musa, all kinds of time. Alabama State brought an outside blitz that didn't get there. On the Florida A&M side of the football field. Yeah, just a tremendous hole on the right side of that special team's defense for Florida A&M and a huge return. 37 yards per game in penalty yardage. It was about double that a year ago. Some pressure put on in the completed pass to Riley. Still on his feet. Riley getting out to the 30-yard line. On the catch for Florida A&M. Here's Musa. Complete. <laughs> to the far side, and it's most of consistency, Coach. Willie Simmons and boy so far it's been pretty consistent. Here's the give on first down across the 45 for the AM. Sheree in motion. Give once again. Yant across the midfield stripe. Getting into Alabama State territory. And it was unable to. And Al Sharid in motion. Musa with the handoff to Yant. Transfer from Nebraska getting across the 45. Get inside penetration. This may be a pooch kick. And it is straight up in the air here on fourth down. And it will hit and take a Rattler bounce inside the 20-yard line to about 
the 17-yard line, and that's where Alabama State will, will begin this drive at their own 17. First down and 10, swing pass, complete across the 20. Keyshawn Johnson had his bird. And whistle stop play. Flags all over the place. Motion now for Alabama State. And nothing doing as we ran on the opposite side of the field, right at about the Florida AM 47 yard line. Here is the run by the quarterback, and this is Damon Stewart, who starts in place of Demetri AM territory. They need to make something happen. Here is the throw, and it's caught by Keyshawn Johnson. Let's see if he was in bounds. They say it was incomplete as he was out of bounds, but a big catch by John. Four receivers set, catch by Juwan Howell, and he doesn't get much across the 40, maybe to the 39-yard line. Coach Robinson said, we got to mix it up. Stewart looking. Complete. Across the 30-yard line, first down, Alabama State. Same look at the top. Same play. Howell with the football. Out of bounds. Stewart gets it to. Well, you see the difference in passing yardage. Wide open. Here's a throw by Stewart. Oh, my Incomplete. goodness. Incomplete. Wide open in the end zone was the tight end A.J. Lewis. High school. On the infraction. Here's Stewart. Stewart escaping pressure. Got to get rid of it. And throws it away. Wow. A touchdown coming off. Been pretty solid here for Coach Robinson. The kick is up. And Alabama State is on the board for three. Well, not what Coach Robinson wanted, I'm sure, but he'll take the points in this case. Exceptions. He's played well so far here in the first half this afternoon as well. Tariq in motion, and here is the give. And slipping on first down, the running back, Terrell Jennings. About the leadership and making sure that these guys know, hey, once you go home, you may be tired, but you still got to help out around the house. Absolutely. Tariq with the catch. Season to convert 38% on third down opportunities. Keep an eye on Nick Dixon. Here's Musa to Cherie. And he is stopped for virtually no gain on third down and seven. <laughs> uh, you can win so far for Alabama State this afternoon, but they have been able to throw the ball for 128. And here's Stewart with the pass, and it is, is that complete to Keyshawn Johnson? What a catch by Keyshawn. Looks like second down here for Alabama State. Throw over the middle, incomplete. They bring some pressure here. Scott in motion. Stewart takes off with the football, gets across the 40 yard line. He stepped out of bounds before he got to first down. Here is Stewart. Throw, catch. And that's a first down. And to who? Big Keisha. Last game against Miles College as well. Swing pass, complete. This is going out to Jawan Howell. And that brings up. Here is the give, I should say the throw by Stewart. And it's incomplete, trying for his favorite. Third down and six now. Good pickup. And this is close to a first down. Take two for two on fourth down. Fourth down and a long yard. And they are not going to make it. Dylan Creech, the fullback, stopped in his tracks and the gets it over the middle. And the Rattlers, big play on first down. In him, second down. 
Musa in trouble. Gets the ball away. Incomplete. Pass was in. Musa with the give. This is Jacquez Yant on the carry. Tool for his program, but as needed, he would definitely dip into it. The give to Yant once again. Jacquez Yant across the 35. And being first guy there, Bubba Adams. Yant in motion. Nice pass to Gassett. And that's part of it. Musa looking complete. Yet in the backfield with him. Musa throws. It's complete. Touchdown, Florida AM. Jamari Gassett with the catch and the score for Fan U. Right down in the secondary, runs right past the linebacker. The safety's on the other side of the field, and that's the easiest throw and catch that Musa and Gassett may have. Nine rushing attempts, they go 11 yards, and they go backwards again. Nothing doing there for Damon to possibly get to the next level. 34 seconds left in the first half of play. Here is the give. And a great tackle here by Florida A&M, and another timeout will be called. No, they're not going to call a timeout. Yes, they will. Great game against South Florida. As a matter of fact, a record-breaking day against South Florida is under center. Handoff in Alabama State. Great job defensively. Nothing doing there on the carry for looking at those, except for Sultan, who had one positive run. Everybody else was a negative run. And here's a positive run for Alabama State. Jawan Howell on the carry. And Jawan Howell is again Alabama State in Florida A&M territory. Here's the throw, and it is tipped and caught. What a catch. In for six, touchdown Alabama State. Asa Gregg. Gets the tip ball and runs it in for the score. Pressure on Stewart. Ducks under two rattlers. Throws the ball into double coverage. And Asa <laughs> grabs it on the tip and takes it to the house. Asa Greg, 6-1 fresh. Wide receivers coach and recruiting coordinator at Miles College. Here's a throw by Musa. Complete. Gain of about four on the play. One other coach that's new for and down. Sharid in motion. And the give to the running back as Jennings. <laughs> to AM. Musa faked the handoff. Try to get it to his wide receiver. First and ten. The handoff to Jennings, who's been getting a lot of carries tonight. One of the helmets of the defenders comes off now. Musa over the middle, caught. Sharif gets the big catch and a first down for the Rattlers. As far as first downs, Florida A&M. And here's Musa in trouble, loses the football. Ball is on the field. And it belongs to the Hornets. Bozeman coming from the blind side was 99. John Smith Cobb that got the football out. Bozeman, it looks like, comes up with the recovery and a huge turnover for Alabama State. First down and 10. Out to Keyshawn Johnson, throws it back oh, the other man. way, trying to find someone open, goes out of bounds. Well, we told you earlier that a trick play was coming. I didn't expect it. Here's the throw complete. Keyshawn Johnson across the 40, <laughs> and he gets quite a bit of it back to the out of third and eight. Stewart looking complete. 
across the midfield stripe, and it looks like Isaiah Scott may have the first down. Wow. And look at this, Alabama State gets the first down. Here's a carry across the midfield stripe, 45 into about the 42 yard. And here's the give, nothing doing here for Alabama State on that play. Yeah, just put on a show here for the fans today. Stewart escapes pressure, throws, and it's incomplete. Solid quarterback for head coach Simmons. Here's the throw over the middle, incomplete. Fanny wanted a flag. Now Fanny will kick the ball away to Alabama State. And the Hornets will get it at about the 40. Good return into Fanny territory. At about the 43 44 yard line. For bringing you today's action from the capital city, Tallahassee. Here's to give minimal gain on the play. And they'll actually give him a gain of about five yards. Rattler's trying to hold on here. Keep an eye on Keyshawn Johnson, number one. And there is the pass to Johnson across the 30 yard line. He lined up in the slot. Able to contain Keyshawn Johnson this afternoon. Here's a give to Howell to cross the 30. Hunt on the tack yesterday. Oh, man. <laughs> Second down, taking over the football, Stewart. And he slides at the 20-yard line, a yard shy of a first down. But there was not, and he gives him a free first down. Here's Stewart looking, getting the pass out. Out to about the 10-yard line. All right, Stewart doing his best. Stewart is out there having a lot of fun today. And here is Sutton once again. Down to about the five-yard line. Actually, it's McMinn. Going to the end zone and <laughs> get this lead. It's like a little movement. McMinn with the run, and he has stopped. No gain on the play on first down and goal. Yeah, just the same people as football. More coming in for Florida a &M. There's Stewart looking. Can't find anybody. Throws it in the end zone. It is incomplete. Third down and goal. Great cover. Stewart. Pass incomplete. Pullback. Creech couldn't hold on to it. Yes. Stewart. Looking incomplete. Jake. The kick is up. Oh, no wow. good. Off to the right. And Musa looking. Big catch. Cherie gets out beyond the 30-yard line. Musa looking over the head of the wide receiver. I mean, clear over his head. He was open momentarily. Ball too high. That's the bull rush. That offensive line has to hold their ground. The give to looks like Cherie. Oh, check that. It's going to be... The tight end. Look, Nick Dixon. Opportunities to score. Here's the give. Fumble on the play. And Alabama State will recover. Jaquez Yant caught the ball up. Looked like somebody stripped it from him. Jaquez Bellamy. This swarm as one defense. Who is that? Number nine ripping the football out. That's young roll. The 6'3 sophomore out of Miami. Big for the Hornets. And nothing doing on first down. You talked about young roll. This is where the Marion 9 came from. You helped start Alabama State University. And it's the Perseverance Award. Yeah, and that's why he wears that number nine, young roll. So great play by him to get the football. 
Coach Gaither, of course, uh, Coach Robinson said he was going to read his autobiography on the way to Tallahassee. Incomplete pass for Florida A&M. Yes. Trip formation. And here's the pass. Complete out to about the 40-yard line, it looks like. Um, it's just a, a great, great football atmosphere and a great place to watch a football game. Musa faked it and had an open receiver, and it was dropped. Late in spurts, but they hadn't played a complete 60 minutes on both sides of the ball. Musa lets this one go, and it is tipped away. Great defense by Alabama State. Mickey Victor. Musa trying to get some breathing room. Escapes, passes, caught. Kamari Young, the tight end, getting the reception. Alabama State showing some blitz here. Musa over the middle, caught. First down, Alabama, first down, Florida A&M. Enders with his eyes doing a nice job. Young Mangio and Sharid were on the same side. Same and play. It is the same play. And Young with the catch and another first down for FAMU. You see the little pummel and then Musa on target. They go up tempo now. Sharid now with the catch here on the wide receiver screen. Gets a few here. Musa up top. Caught. A great catch and a first down. Jared. At least three, but seven would be ideal if you're Florida AM. Musa, nice fake on the handoff. And a great job by Jeremiah Pruitt. Just kind of gaining control of the football. Musa, pass complete. Secondary. Jennings with the carry. No gain on the play. Station when you get to the offensive line meeting room on Monday. Here's the throw. Manigo. Incomplete. Great defense there by Alabama State. And again, there's been. Musa looking. Musa lets it go at the last minute. Nearly intercepted. Florida AM. Kick is up, and it is good. 17 10 now. The Rattler is now on top by a touch. Six yards to try to tie this ball game up. Tall task here for the Hornets. Here is the give on first down. Look at the pile just being pushed out to about the 20 yard line. The, there's been no whistle. And. Here's a toss out to the 10 and maybe out to the, about the 16, 17 yard line. See Florida and m maybe. Stewart looking. Is this caught by Keyshawn Johnson? Yes, it is, and that's a first down. Well, if you're Alabama State, that's all. May take a shot deep here. Scott in motion. Uh -oh. Here's Stewart, and it's picked off by Florida A&M. This one could go back for six. Touchdown, Rattlers. Interception return for a touchdown. Decision of the night by Stewart. Off his back foot, three defenders around Keyshawn Johnson, and major just dragging Isaiah Scott into the end zone. 6'1", 230-pound seat. Total domination by Oregon. Over 500 yards of offense. Here's a throw, caught. And that's going to be Asa Gregg on the catch. From Could have upon African-American coaches here at the HBCU level, and both of these coaches were very complimentary of uh, Coach Sanders, even Coach Eddie Robinson, Jr. He stayed and whatnot. Third down and short. Getting all of this notoriety. One 
and we'll get to it after this big fourth down play. Fourth and one, here's the throw, and it is incomplete. Is there going to be a flag on the play? No, no flag. Do is continue to propel the opportunity for African-American coaches, because there are some very good coaches in this country that just deserve a shot. Yeah, absolutely. You look at a coach like Willie Simmons, you know, his sixth year here at Florida A&M, ranked. Moose is still in the game, incomplete, right in, the, right at the feet of the wide receiver on second down and 15. And Cherie could not catch that football. Here is the give to the running back. Out to the 20. Still short of a first down. To be Prairie View and Grambling State Fair Classic. Musa looking. Caught by Sharid inside the 15-yard line and out of bounds with 49 seconds remaining. I would not be having my quarterback dropping back to pass in this situation. But he does. Musa looking, going for the end zone, incomplete. All right, a little gamesmanship here That's between the two coaches. <laughs> Musa with the handoff, going right back at it. This time Alabama State is ready. And still a little skirmishing going on after the play as time gets ready to explode.